Hello, welcome to Catholic Online's Prayer Request Live from the California Studios. Prayer is something so special to me. First Theologians 5, 16 to 18 reminds us, always be joyful, pray constantly, and for all things give thanks. This is the will of God for you in Christ Jesus. Together, let us pray for the needs of our brothers and sisters. Please remember these intentions in your daily prayers. We pray for Melissa. Please pray for Justin as he is struggling with addiction issues. Please pray that he is healthy and happy and has a good outcome at this meeting. Amen. We pray for Maria. Help me please, Almighty. Send me financial help somehow. Winter has been difficult for me and the costs have got to me. I want to be free of debt and receive help from you. A financial miracle is needed. Amen. We pray for Sonia. Please, my God, help Nicole with her depression and help all of my family that suffers very much. Be here with us and support us. Amen. We pray for Susie and Tony. Pray for the restoration of our marriage. Amen. We pray for Michelle. Please pray for my peace, that I am relieved of all heartache, guilt, and anxiety. Please pray for my career and a financial breakthrough. Pray for my parents and sons and heal them of all pain and worry. Amen. We pray for Chris, for my Abby. She is a beautiful nine-year-old girl with autism. Every day seems harder and harder for all of us, especially for her. I pray that her voice comes out and lets us know what her needs and wants are. I love you so much. Amen. We pray for Denise. Dear Lord, I am thankful and grateful for all of your blessings. Dear Lord, I pray for continued good health, peace, and prosperity for me and my family and friends. Dear Lord, I pray for more togetherness, empathy, and unity. In Jesus' name, amen. We pray for Irish. Remove Marie from my husband's workplace. Strengthen mine and Ted's marriage. Amen. We pray for Greg. Please pray with me that the Lord Jesus grants me miracles and blessings and guides me to my life of happiness, joy, and freedom. Amen. We pray for Will. Please pray for Emma W., her mom, her dad, her brothers and sisters, and all the rest of her family, that they would be brought into a relationship with God via the blood and sacrifice of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. We pray for Russell. Thank you for all I have. I have been homeless and drifting for much of the past six years. I've been having considerable difficulty walking and working. I've been trying to find work, but my options are limited. I'm trying to file for disability right now, but the process is cumbersome. I need a home. It doesn't need to be much. Simple with kitchen and bath. Please help me to get started again, Lord. Amen. We pray for Anne. Dear Lord, please guide me through this family and financial situation. I am so grateful for your guidance to this point. Please, Lord, show me the way. Amen. We pray for Brenda Lee. Lord, please help Troy. He needs you now more than ever. Amen. We pray for Megan. Father, bless and protect me. I pray I have a successful evening and weekend at work. I am truly grateful. I'm having my surgery in two weeks. I pray I am extremely happy with the results. Thank you for all of your countless blessings and graces in my life, Lord. Amen. We pray for Philip. My cousin Jeff was diagnosed with cancer. He needs a miracle. Amen. Let us take this time to pause and pray the Hail Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Now let us continue with today's remaining prayer intentions. We pray for Shelley. Please pray for me to have clear and perfect vision. Thank you and God bless you. Amen. We pray for Irene. Pray for son's good health and to get the job where he will be happy. Amen. We pray for Deborah. Please pray that my daughter Lauren is freed from evil influence and is completely healed of her bipolar disorder. Please break the generational curse upon her and her family. In the name of Jesus, amen. We pray for Mark. 
Thank you so much for everything. I pray that I will pay my financial debts quickly and be on the road to live debt free. I pray that I have money in my bank account tomorrow and forever to help pay my debts and provide a humble and fruitful life for me and my future family. I pray to you, Lord, help me as you have never left my side. Amen. We pray for Ray, for my marriage which is struggling at the moment. Amen. We pray for Eileen. Dear Jesus, through you all things are possible, so I pray that my son will choose my suggestion and do what I feel is best for him. I pray that his foot heals without surgery and that his life becomes easier. For him I pray, my dear sweet Jesus. Amen. I pray for Alisani. I ask God above to walk by my son's side to give him strength, patience, and wisdom in this time of need. I pray for the strength, love, and guidance to support my son at this time. Amen. We pray for Rob. Please pray for my wife and unborn baby. We've had five miscarriages, all in the first trimester, and now she is nine to ten weeks along. Thank you, God, and God bless. Amen. We pray for Patricia. I pray for a financial burden to be lifted from my shoulders on the sale of my property that I own. I pray for a restful mind, one that is not worried, ever waking up in the hour. In Jesus' name I pray. We pray for Timothy. I ask for prayer for my wife, Stacy, and I. Our marriage is bad right now, as she's left. I ask for prayers to reunite us and work on our marriage. We are both at fault in not letting go of the past and concentrating on the future. I do love her dearly. Amen. We pray for Stephen. Please pray that my wife and I will be healed and restored emotionally and spiritually and for the healing and restoration of our marriage. I need a miracle. Please pray that my wife will forgive me and change her mind about all of this. Amen. We pray for Carla. Please pray that Stephen will be freed from his addiction to meth and all of the other drugs and alcohol, that he will be able to resist his urges so that he can be the man God wants him to be. Please pray that he is free from the demons of addiction. We ask this in the name of Jesus. Amen. We pray for Katerina, that Kevin and Paula will reconcile their relationship. God has brought them together, and he will wrap a hedge of protection around them. Please pray for them. Amen. We pray for Susie. I just went to confession tonight after being away from the church for almost 10 years. Yay. I want to start back going to Mass, but I have a husband who doesn't want to go and doesn't want me to go. Please pray for me to find a way to come back to Mass and work things out with my husband. I am so thankful for God's forgiveness and need to find a way to do this in my life. Amen. We pray for McKinley. Dear God, in the name of Jesus, I ask you to give me back my job. Please hear my urgent prayer and return me to what, from what the enemy has stolen. In Jesus' name, amen. Now let us pray the Our Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please go to our Catholic Online Prayer Request Live page to submit your prayer request to be prayed for live with our community. Remember, like us on Facebook and subscribe to Catholic Online's YouTube channel. Have a blessed day. See you back here tomorrow at 9 a.m. Pacific Time.